just you went know. right into, hey, are you looking for a refinance? Are you looking to purchase dude, something dude, new? I mean, dude, I've had plenty, assuming the sale. I mean, I've had plenty of women sit at a bar and look good, start good, and not do good. <laughs> You know, they get all dressed up. They got freaking, they got the, the drop and the whole, the whole thing, all the cleavage is showing and everything skirts right up to here, you know. And then you come on to them, guys. You guys know what I'm talking about. And they're acting like, hi, you want to, huh? You think you're getting some of this? The way you dressed? You came out, okay, to hook me. Come on, man. Don't, don't, don't start acting. Why, why, well, it just depends. It depends on what? You a virgin? Yeah. Yeah, I am. <laughs> Jared. I'm going over the top. Nah. Okay. What are so we look, doing? How are we doing this time, man? This is the mystery shop show. Oh, yeah, okay. we have plenty of time. This is the mystery shop mystery show. Mystery shopping. Mystery shopping. Look, you got to make sure that when, when the minute. call... Two minutes is actually 30 seconds. 20 seconds. Okay. When the call comes in... The opening, okay? Qualification. Get their home phone number. Appointment. Lock it down. When we come back, we're going to show you how. Lockdown. down. What? All right. Okay. Tell right, the guys at Periscope, right, we appreciate it. Hey, you guys Periscope. on Periscope, 305-865-8668. I never could see the stream for some reason. I cannot see my <laughs> own damn stream. You got my cell phone? Pull it up. Um, well, I want to see it from here that because it, cause it gets a little it's a Periscope stream. Streaming. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, appreciate you guys joining us today. I hope you got something out of that. Most people suck on the phone. We hope you don't. 95% okay. of customer interactions take place over the phone. 87% of the people don't like the way you handle they them. report being dissatisfied. Huge opportunity, guys. Huge, huge, huge opportunity. Right, Jared? Yep. I'm speaking my voice. I'm getting my time on Periscope right now. Are you going to do some Periscoping now? I'm just Periscoping. I'm, I'm in the comments. I'm in the comments. I'm commenting. I'm engaging with the folks. This is my time. My time now. You can get your time. Saludos desde México, Distrito Federal. Your hair on fleek. Who's fleek? I can be. Who's fleek? Yeah, we're not streaming anymore, right? Fleek, fleek. No, no, we are. We are still. Oh, we are still. Okay. Yeah. Three, two. One. And we are back, Young We're Hustlers, back. the mystery shopper with Grant Cardone, yeah. Mr. Adam okay. Grant Cardone. Initial rapport. Hey, welcome. Thank you for calling. Thank you for calling Quick and Loans. Thank you for calling the car dealership. Thank you for calling Cardone Enterprises. And then so they're going to respond, and then this is the mistake that most people make. Most people think that you have to use this as an opportunity to build rapport. Oh, how are you today? Dude, when you call somebody, your if, she would have, if she would have called and said, hey, well, how's the weather period? How's the weather where you're calling from? Yeah. I'm like, I'm not I'm not calling about the weather. I'm calling about my goddamn rates on the mortgage. Yeah. Weather don't matter. Yeah. What'd you have for breakfast? She actually built Did credibility. You granola or banola? She, she built credibility by going right in, assuming the sale and going in for the data gathering. Yeah, and then she blew it. She blew it. She hit the roadblock when she wouldn't answer the freaking rate question. Yeah. So when you want to answer the rate question, the price question, the appraisal question, mm -hmm. what's it worth, what's it cost, all you, all you do is you basically make that person more carnivorous. Well, you know, you want to know why? If I tell my kids. Because look, right now. I, you can't right, have right candy. Now, right what now. do you think Sabrina's going to say? You can't have candy? Yeah. Why not? Why not? She's going to go into why yeah. not, and she's going to become basically sugar starved. So the way to handle her is, I'd be happy to get you to rate. Be happy to, okay? You want to do 15 or 30, okay? It's going to be over 300 grand or under 300 grand. Because with the click of a button, I just found out what the best interest rates are going to be online. So look, folks, people people have access to information. The reason they're calling you is because they're interested in buying something. So use the qualification as a way to avoid giving prices. I'll be happy to give you a payment, an exact rate, exact terms. Everything fact, that you'll need. What I'd like to do is text it to you so you can have it in print. This is a great time to grab their text number by offering a gift. Give. And then the, the lock is, you know, we mm. it, we actually we have a company policy where we're required to text information. So there's no confusion. That we communicate so that there's no okay. confusion and there's no misunderstanding. Let me talk to two market media. Hank, Hank, you there, Hank? Yeah, one second. Hank, Hank, you don't even have Hank. a phone number on your freaking uh, website, website, bro. <laughs> I don't need one. You don't want anybody calling you, bro? There you go. There you go. You, where are you calling from today, honey? Dude, I love New York. Oh, uh, go ahead, man. man. So, Hank, have you ever called a company? We're doing Mystery Shopper today, as you may or may not know. 
Have you, yeah, okay. Have you ever called a show and they suck on the phone? <laughs> yeah, right? So, I mean, how easy is it, Hank? Because, I mean, Hank, do, tell everybody what you do for a living. Yeah. Well, we want to know why you haven't been delivering shows because everybody loves the star power Dude, show. Dude, it's they, like it's like the most requested show, second to And they're like, hey, why players. why isn't Hank delivering shows, man? Oh, I love that. Uh, okay. I love that. I love shows in the game. But, so Hank, what, what mistake do you see people that, that want to be media stars? I mean, people come to you and they want to be a star or what? Can we get no, they can't. Oh, I'm sorry. It's Periscope. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. And just so you guys know, Hank and Steve are partners in New York. They're two market medias, the company. Like they, they've been down here. They see what we really do. Oh, like yeah. you guys see me beat up Twitter and streams and Meerkat. Let me tell you what I do, dude. As soon as I get a lead, next thing I'm in their face. I'm calling them yeah. on the phone. John, Grant Cardone. Okay, I want to do a deal with you. I mean, I can't tell you how many times I've called Stephen Hank and said, hey man, I don't care if it's the holidays. Let's go see the people. Freak, I'll get on a plane. I'll fly to New York, yep. right? Yep. I'm in your face, Hank. No. And they don't have that urgency. That Everybody urgency, wants to be right? a star. Yeah. Everybody wants to be a star, but they want you to do the freaking... They, they want, want you to runs. do the... Uh, 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 they, they want you to do the running and the labor. Yeah, yeah. Hank, thanks for calling in, brother. Hey, John from Baltimore. John, you here? What's going on, brother? Do, do you own the company? Okay, what's the name of the, what's the phone number? Uh, can you mute him out real Four, quick? So four, four, three, doesn't... what? Huh? 927? 7195. What do they sell, man? <laughs> okay, I need a charge for my phone. Thank you for calling Web Mechanics. Web Mechanics. Recording, strike one. Just press zero. For sales, press one. Oh, there you go. If you're a customer, press Do you want to do this one or you yeah. want to do it? You, you, you. do it. All right, let's go to some music. No, Hi. too late. Hello. You want to do, you want to do him? Don't be so hard on them. Okay. You're, not, you're, you're, you're way harder than me. Okay. Because you jerk people around. I, know. I don't. I just get straight yeah. to it. Like I would do this call. How many of you think... See, I'm already pissed off now. I'm fucking pissed off right now, okay? I, I, I'm, I'm moving into insanity. Now, John, Hold John, me. these are your buddies? John, can you hear me? Dude, they might have a sales problem. Dude, they I think they smoke... Wait. Do these guys smoke weed? That means yes. That means they, yes. They smoke weed that during. Means yes. Well, now the question is, do they smoke weed during the day? Dude, you know they do. That's a stoner mentality right here. It is some okay. nice old music, though. Okay, John. <laughs> what? Hey, Alex. You know how long I've been on hold, man? What, 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 let me ask you, what's your commitment to service over there? When, you, when, when I go to do a deal with y'all, how much how much service am I going to get? Uh, it depends on what the projects are. Have you spoken with someone over here before? No, uh-uh. This is my first time to call. Okay. What uh, kind of service are you interested in? Do, do you guys build websites? I need three websites built. It's in front of us. Three websites. 
Okay. And, and, and then, yes. then I'll, okay, okay, now, what kind of service do you give people? So, we do website building and design. I'm not talking about that. What kind of, how, do you have a commitment to good service, to taking care of me? Yes, of course. Okay. Well, all I'm saying to you, dude, I've been on, I've been on hold over a minute. Okay. Okay. So look, uh, uh, can you build? Can you build? Web, like, what, any? I mean, can you tell me about what it would cost to build a website? Are you all right? Yeah, I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> oh, thank you. Good service. Ten thousand. Ten thousand per website. Ten thousand per website. <clears throat> Okay, and then, and then, do you how guys long, have how the, long, Jared? How long? And, and do they outsource to India? What's the time, time on that? Can you do me a favor then? Can you do me a favor? Can you look up the website GrantCardoneTV.com? GrantCardoneTV.com, and then maybe you guys can send me a, a an estimate. Sure. Um, who would you like us to get in contact with? You can contact Grant Cardone. All right. Okay. What's, then, a, what's a good number or email address? Grant Cardone. A grant, uh, or yeah, you can send it to send it to Sherry at GrantCardone.com. Sherry, S H E R I. Right, that that that's my that's my uh, code name, Mark. Sherry, S H E R I, at GrantCardone.com. Mm -hmm. GrantCardone.com. Yeah. You ever heard of me? I, I have not. I apologize. I apologize. My bad. My, my bad. My bad. <laughs> That's all right. Is there okay. a that number where we can reach you as well? Sure. 310-777-0255. Hey, I look off. When, when do you think I could see a, a proposal from you guys? I, I'll hand this off right now and uh, get somebody working on it. Uh, Dude, awesome. I appreciate it. Okay, we're very, very serious about three websites. Great. And what was your name, sir? My name's Grant. Okay, Grant. My name's Alex. Thanks, thanks man. Thanks, thanks. Okay, John, what'd you, how'd you think he did, dude? Pretty well. Yeah, totally new. Okay. But you know who trained him? One of the old guys. <laughs> Where, so where's the opportunity, right? Is, does he work for this company? No. Oh, okay, this is just your buddy's company. Okay, well, what, what information are you going to tell your buddy after hearing that call? Dude, look, I'm, I'm seriously in the, in the market for three websites, okay? We just built the website out. I'm not happy with it. I'm going to change it. I'm going to spend money to fix it. But, but the fact that he, it, it took that long for me to be ding, 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 that even the music was bad, dude. You get put on hold at my office, you know what you're going to hear, hear? Hey, yeah. it's time. It's time. And we don't want anybody, do I not go insane here if the phone rings more if than once? If it rings more than twice, it's for you. It's company policy. Dude, I'm telling you, I want to kill people because I want to rush. I want to be in a hurry to help yep. people. Yep. And, and that's what I'm saying. These guys are stoners, bro. Creeping, creeping. So pass that information on a lot of people. And we can help them, man. I mean, yeah. that's an easy fix. Yeah, that's 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 about a, a four month turnaround on on a Cardone University program. I wouldn't even take that long, dude. I turn that around today. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, he just got rattled, man. Hey, thanks for calling in, John. I appreciate it. So, folks, what are you getting out of this? Because I'm not calling the people to make fun of them, okay? We're, We're not calling to give people a hard time. We're no, not calling man. to waste people's time. We're doing this for you. If you're watching the show, this is so that you can actually learn something. You can learn something about the awareness that you have to have on a phone call. When somebody calls in, you need to be present. You need to be present. From this morning. Yeah, man. You gotta be present. You gotta be present on every call. You gotta be present with every question. You gotta be present with Who do we want to call? Who y'all y'all trying to buy anything? Let's, right let's, now? let's talk to Juan Perez. Hey Juan, what's up? Juan, what's happening, man? It's time. It's time to talk to Juan. Let me hear it. Let me hear it, Juan. It's time. I love it, dude. Okay. Hey, what have you learned, Juan, from today's show? <laughs> 